it's home with Simon after a 3-1 win against Stockport County. Got to be happy with the response from the bar match. Yes, definitely. Um, I, I thought we passed it up, the ball around a lot better, and that's what we demanded. Macker and I after the game the other day at Barrow. I don't think I don't think we completed more than three or four passes. Um, you know, in the game, you know, uh, it, it, it was a poor performance, but we wanted a response, and that's a sign of a good team if you can get that from uh, from your players. And uh, we've got good quality um, players, good quality squad, and we need to utilise that and the pitch as well. That's what we keep saying. And, we just wanted them to be a bit braver after the barrel game. We practiced that, and um, it came off today. And especially 15, 20 minutes before half time, it was a purple patch. I was going to say it's a bit of a slow start to the game. Was there any sort of like concerns creeping in towards the, the end of the first half? No, th- th- there were a couple of tweaks really. Um, namely, we needed a bit of a threat, more of a threat in behind. Everyone was coming towards the ball, and uh, we needed to stretch them. Uh, but as soon as we put that right. And, and it was either Woodsy or Chris Hall or uh, Ashley Warsfold uh, doing some uh, good runs in behind after a good inventive play then. Um, we had that threat and it stretched the game and, and then we got in pockets of space and hurt them. I mean, did you think it was going to be a case of you know quick goals? I mean, we scored three very quick goals or do you think the match could have been a bit more long and drawn out and then we might have copped a goal at the end? No, I, I, I believe we'd win the game if we carried out the game plan and I think we've got the pace and, and the ability um, to win games if, if we carry out the game plan but um, it's when we don't it's when we go a bit nervy and, and then start getting marked by players and not making ourselves available that we don't play to our strengths I mean Stockport came on strong and we knew that they would do and were you pleased with the defence in the second half because they seemed especially to be tight in the second half and uh, kept things out yeah I mean they're bound to have a, a spell aren't they um, and it's human nature to, to drop off and protect that lead and as much as I'm wanting us not to and still to you know, um, go for the throats and I, I wanted to, to increase that scoreline and, and to be better again you know we still haven't um, achieved anything here and anywhere near what I want you know I think we're getting towards it in that 15 minutes before half time um, but we dropped off and that enabled them to come at us a bit but uh, to be fair to the defenders that you know we've conceded four and I think five games and um, it was a deflection off a cross and then a deflect, deflected goal today. So, uh, other than that, they've done well. And Craig's performance in goal as well must have been pleasing. He seemed to be very settled, pulling off some good catches. Safe hands? Safe hands from crosses, but I don't think he was very busy. Um, he wasn't under too much stress today. Lovely save from the free kick, though, in the first half. Yeah, it was. It was. The lad did to a decent free kick and um, it was a good save. I'd expect that, I'd expect that from him because I've got high expectations of him. You know, he's a very good keeper. Now we spoke before the match, and you said that even though the Ferry game when we won five nil, you know it was a good game, good scoreline, but you weren't, you know, you weren't wholly satisfied with the the team what they can put in. Was this match different, or are you expecting you know to kick on now from this kind of result? I, I thought there were, I, I said that uh, that period before half time when you know we, we, we knocked in three goals, but it wasn't just that; it was the manner of our play. Uh, we played like we trained, and that's the aim. Uh, I want lads to enjoy the game here. I want lads to get on the ball and and um, not always play percentage stuff, but uh, be safe and secure on the ball and look after it. But enjoy playing football. You know, I spent most of my career just in survival mode and edit and kick it, edit and kick it, mark someone out of the game. But we've got players with good ability who can drop off and play in the right areas and do the right thing. No, because we've got no tricky tie coming up soon with Telford. Have you been to see them? I haven't had a chance yet, no, because we've played when they have and um, it's been difficult but I'll, get, I'll be getting reports from other managers and uh, discover what they're about. I know Liam Watson's teams are always a real handful, he's got a great record at this level and um, it's something that you know, I'll be aspiring to over the next two years, what he's achieved. Uh, but there's a lot there's a lot to go at, um, it's a fine pitch uh, which will be very similar to ours so it'll be a good game and hopefully between two good sides. That's great. Thank you very much, Sam. Thank you.